It looks like Montana's political landscape is about to undergo a seismic shift. The New York Times and the website Politico reported today that Governor Steve Bullock is poised to enter the U.S. Senate race to challenge Republican Senator Steve Daines. MTN Chief Political Reporter Mike Dennison has been following the story as well. Governor Bullock has been telling people for months he had no interest in challenging Senator Daines this year. But in the past month, National Democrats have upped the pressure on him to run, with personal contacts by former President Obama and Senate Minority Leader Chuck Schumer. The Times also reported Wednesday that Bullock's family appears more supportive of the idea. Montana State University political scientist David Parker also told MTN News that other factors may have contributed to Bullock's potential change of heart. What made it a bit more acceptable to him was one, looks like Joe Biden's going to potentially head the Democratic ticket. That's an easier lift, I think, for him to run statewide with Biden rather than Sanders at the top of the ticket. And the second thing is Bullock could be the hero. He could be the, this could be the seat that gives the Democrats the lift that they need. Multiple sources have told MTN News this week that they expect him to announce on Monday, the last day for candidate filing, that he has changed his mind and will enter the contest. We called Bullock on Tuesday evening, but he had yet to reply by late Wednesday. And neither the governor nor anyone close to him has confirmed his plans. National Republicans quickly attacked Bullock on Wednesday. The National Republican Senatorial Committee said he lacks the character and values Montana's expect from a senator and cited his support for impeaching President Trump. But if Bullock does run, Parker says at a minimum, it will be a huge help for Democrats up and down the ticket in Montana, from the governor's race to U.S. House to the legislature. There's no way the Democrats could build a ground game without having a competitive Senate race in the ballot. If you get those resources, they can do it, and that's going to help people like Kathleen Williams, it's going to help the governor's race, it's going to help even some of these lower tier races. Game on, it's going to be a fun year, it's going to be an expensive year. If Bullock gets into the Senate race, it goes from a few million dollars to tens of millions. One of the biggest U.S. Senate races in the country. Will he do it? We'll know by Monday. In Helena, Mike Dennison, MTN News. Three other largely unknown Democrats are already in the Senate race. If Bullock enters, he'd be a clear favorite to win the primary.